All right, hello everyone. Welcome back to Spelletons. I'm Zinker. He's Derek, and this is Maze. Uh, while I was taking, well, I I try I tried the poop, but it was, I really did, and it kept feeling like I was gonna, and then I didn't. So I I'm having a problem right now. But I looked up uh, what to do, and when I say I looked up what to do, I mean mm -hmm. I looked at like one. A short clip of a video and it showed me what to do with the rancid corn oil mm -hmm. however it doesn't appear I can actually do that which means we're still lost as to what I'm sp supposed to be doing um, okay yeah Hmm. Well, do this do, is. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. I, I saw a bathtub, but there was no box. Like this gamer this girl bathwater in there. Yeah, I, I, Derek, I don't want gamer girl. I want gamer corn bathwater. Thank you. Ah. Corn yeah. Water. Fucking gamer girls, we're done. Friendship over with gamer girls. Gamer coins where it's at now. Gamer maze, if you will. This doesn't look like it. I'm pretty certain the bath. It's, must be a different bathroom I'm trying to get to. Where could this bathroom be? Must be a different bathroom. Right? Yeah, here we go. Bam. Bathtub plug. This particular plug fits perfectly into the bathroom sink on the first floor of the farmhouse. It is also a talking plug. But due to a bad case of laryngitis, you'll never know that. An old sink. There you go. Rancid corn oil. There you Wasn't go. Wasn't for very long. Okay. You did it. I did it. What's this? Nail clippers. Uh, vigilant as you are when it comes to personal hygiene, the only two things these clippers will do for you are grip something lodged in a wall and give you a 100% te tetanus guarantee. That's it. Something nailed into a wall. Nailed into a wall. Nail, Nail clippers. Wall. Nail clippers. Hmm. Brain blast, Derek. I have an idea. I think I, I think I think I've come up oh. with a new recipe. I think I've gotten the solution. <laughs> See this outhouse with the nail in it? Mm -hmm. This is jammed in the wall, not nailed in the wall. But if I go on the other side. Yes, what's on the other side? <laughs> I'd zinker. I, well, you know what? I I was I was searching for the content joke. Anyhow, you know, I got a rusty nail at the nail clippers. <laughs> for some reason, the first thing that pops in your head is that it would be a good conductor of electricity, possibly as a fuse. You are very strange. Okay. That sounds like something that pop up in my head. Yeah. Good thing I, I, I'm not very strange. <laughs> yeah. You're definitely normal, Derek. As is me walking this way, but my ear was itchy. So, you have to excuse me. Is that, oh, there's a flyer pot. Uh, it's a conductor of electricity. What the hell does that mean? Do I have to straighten it out? <gasps> Mallet straighten things out. I put it in the fuse box. What oh, fuse you know box? What? It kind of like that thing would be. Uh, I'm sure there's a fuse box somewhere. I mean, yeah. Yeah, it looks like it fits here. It doesn't. Okay. Well, I got. I gotta be honest with you. I now don't know what to do. I didn't discover any old fuse box or anything. I feel like I haven't explored this first well, floor all that take much. Take a look though. around. Yeah. It's like it looks like the lights are out. It it does look like that in this room. Maybe it's because I haven't turned them on. Um. Now the switch is up. I think you can do anything with that? Nope. Now, oh. Hello. Huh. 
Unlock secret door, making much less secret. Okay. There you go. Oh. That looks like a fuse box. What else is down here before I go to the fuse box? You have no Hello. Hello. Ding dong. Okay. I opened the shortcut to the farmhouse. Okay. A fuse box. Missing a fuse. Use rusty nails a fuse against safety regulations. Store power the farmhouse. It is slightly less stark than it was before. Neato! Is that a fucking Geiger counter gauge or whatever? No, it's not a Geiger counter. That's not what they sound like. Mm. Oh, I can't open this door. That's not that kind of ticking. What am I hearing then, Derek? It's, it's Sounds like the lights just struggling. Well, not how lights actually sound when they struggle, though. Yeah, it's a CD player. I got a CD. Picked up a CD. Good for you. New path is open to you. To the barn and silo. Old CD. An old CD. Its label faded. Pressed on the first batch of CDs ever created. Or the first batch of CDs ever created. This brand was notoriously expensive and even more unreliable, making even the greatest of symphony sound like something a concussed elephant would make while stumbling around a music shop. It's fair. Alright, barn or silo, Derek? Well, actually, I think we have to go this way. So, I think this is the way to go. That was a windmill right, over well, there. Alright, well, that way. Hold the shift key to sprint. Why would I need to sprint? Alright, well, I hear stuff scrambling around. So maybe I will sprint. But the music has to turn into, uh, oh shit, you better run or you're gonna die. You're stuck. Remember to press E to examine your equipped items for clues. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've done that each time. They're funny. Um. Oh. Hello? Okay. The silo is down that way. But I did skip ahead a little bit and saw the guy went into the barn. So, maybe we go into the barn first. Um, what's in this barn? Seems natural to... Seems like a good idea to check out while we're here. Mm hmm. Horseshoes. Hmm. Nothing lights up that I know. A book titled, Coin of the World. A book outlining the differences and similarities of coin species coin across the globe. Coin of your world. Several chapters also discuss the color yellow. A few species are circled in red pen, while no, no, no appears in many places across the entire book in blue pen. Hmm. Wait, is that something up there? No, I don't think so. Bunch of hay in this barn. Hey. Bunch of barn in this hay. I was hoping you would say barn. You, you, you missed the joke, Derek. I got broom! There's a pile of something or other you can sweep up with this. We already knew that. What you didn't know was that this broom is haunted. This will not affect your adventure in any way, as the ghost is currently away on business. <laughs> they have a lot of funny quips about all the items. I'm gonna come sweep yeah. something up. Good to have. Sweeping time, motherfuckers. Always appreciate it. Sweepy DP. <gasps> What is this? One half of a diagram. A diagram torn in half. Contains very complicated looking equations scribbled in orange pen. A drawing of a person in a DNA helix. Looks very important. You tried to eat it at first, but changed your mind when you couldn't find any salt. We do a lot of well, weird stuff things. Off screen. We do yeah. <laughs> we do a lot of weird things with the stuff we find, you know? I guess we're really hungry. If only I had some sort of food I could eat. Something that appears in most other foods. Something that reminds me of a maze. Something that I've once witnessed on Pornhub. Ah, that's right. Something Pussy. we once fetched for a guard. Did we? Oh, we went to pizza. Ways. I, I, I would say I was. 
I, I was thinking of the guards in uh, Shadwood when we got him pulling. I... Oh. Yeah, that's right. I forgot about that part. Do you? I just made it up, but... I... <laughs> Silo! It's joke. locked. Told me I had some sort of bobby pin. Get on the floor, you stupid lock. Open silo door. <laughs> Look at me being smart. Can't go around the other side. Cannot go around the outside. Eminem has surely let me outside? down. An old telescope. Oh. Manufactured about a century ago, this telescope's effective range is the tops of low-hanging trees. Possibly because the lenses were put on backwards. Looks like it was used frequently with varying results. Okay. What's this? Though it's hard to make out, this blueprint looks like it's for the construction of a very large and very poorly planned facility with a farm situated on top of it. The facility itself actually set an architectural record of having the largest number of corridors that lead absolutely nowhere. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Anything else in here? Pile of corn candles. There you go, I swept it up. And needle... I'm sorry, what are these? Needle nose pliers. You saw something that sausage grinder that could be removed with these pliers. You know this because you spent an uncomfortable amount of time trying to pull it out with your hands, making no progress whatsoever. Well, that is true. I don't know how they. Yeah, that is true. That is. I sure true. make a lot of chair sounds. You really do. Uh, is the maze not entertaining you, Derek? There's a lot to do in this maze. No, I try to get more comfortable. We're, get we're getting pliers applying something out of a sausage grinder. Wonder what it is. Do you think it's a sausage or do you think it's a grinder? Like the app? I meant more like the sandwich. I don't think you can pull the app out of a sausage grinder. Oh, speaking of grinder. Uh... Okay, what? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, go, go for it. I want to hear this. Warped key fob uh, out of the sausage grinder. Not an ideal Someone place, earlier right? today. Wait, hold on. Sorry. Whip key fob. This whip key fob would be useful if you could flatten it back to its original shape. At first, you tried to do this by staring very hard at it. It didn't work, so you set out to find a tool that will do the job much better. Hmm. All right, go for it. Uh. Earlier at work, uh, someone asked uh asked er, asked me uh if I uh, or uh. uh how many yeah, times yeah. I've been asked uh, if I wanted to do it in the butt? How many times so I, were you I sat asked? There, I thought about it and I was like... At least a couple. And really? I didn't specify. Well, I didn't specify if it was a girl or a guy you asked. Right, I, I assume they probably thought it was a guy. What? Alright, Derek. How many people have asked no. you? How many of them have been girls? This came up... The, the way this came up, I don't think that I don't think that was the I don't think that was the impression that they got, and I don't think they picked up on the joke I was going for there. That wasn't really a joke at all. I don't think they picked up on where I was leading with it. Where were you leading with it? It can be Derek. It can be literally anywhere. Because I don't think that that uh, when I when I said at least a couple of times that I meant that, uh, that I was talking about guys. Ah, okay. They thought it was, it was all, a girl it was, that it asked was, you. Yeah. Well, so the way it started is I was walking by a couple of the servers, and one of them just turned to me for, and said, Hey, you want to do it in the butt? Uh, wait, wait. Uh, wait, one of the... Oh, okay. This key fob has been smashed so perfectly flat that you can't help but toss it like a frisbee to see how far it goes. You regret your decision immediately. That's fair. Stop pressing uh, Q. She was gonna do something at some point. It's going to, I know. What okay, is this? I feel like it has to do it. It has to do something. That's a little concerned. Uh, very fashionable um. fedora. Item added to folio. A very fashionable fedora worn by a very fashionable person. Due to this, you're not putting it on your head as you've not earned the right. On the inner tag, the owner wrote his name, Fernando. Charred name tag. 
Took you several hours to stare, but you managed to deduce that the name tag, in fact, belongs to the dead person who was near. And that his name is Fernando. Took you several more hours to notice that the dead person was a lab assistant. And then five more minutes to realize you were trying to read this thing upside down the whole time. Well, they got me. Has any girl uh, ever asked you to do it in the the thing? Oh, there's a dead guy here. No, no. No one I think or, I've never gone anywhere with anybody. Doesn't mean someone hasn't asked you. That's not true. Somebody said they wanted to date you but fuck other men. I remember that. Yeah, yeah, that was in high school. It's different. High school doesn't I, mean anything. I suppose. Glove severed hand. A severed hand. Uh, Perfectly preserved in the glove that encases it. It could come in handy if you could give yourself a hand and find a way to loosen and get that glove off. The first pun was intended, but not the second. What's the second pun? Oh, it should come in handy. If you could give yourself a hand and find a way to loosen... I gotcha. It's very handy. You give yourself a hand. Alright. Uh... What if I put it in the sausage the thing, grinder? See, like, I, I, I thought about it afterwards thinking too, and I was like, you know, I feel like that, I feel like there's no situation where someone asks me to do it in the butt and it's not my butt. <laughs> that's, no that's the one in, in that's the one uh like being done in. Oh yeah. They yeah. I if, obviously you're the one taking it in the ass, yeah. Is that not clear? I guess it wasn't clear to everyone. It was clear to me. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <it's a> <laughs> so, sorry, I, sorry, I know stuff about you. I'm really <laughs> cool. Loose it. Let, I don't think it's glove a from the severed hand. Slightly disgusting. Severed hand. Once you manage to tear away, tear away from giving yourself an unending stream of high fives with this hand, you may want to find an actual use for it. And it's not to start another round of high fives. Oh my god. Great. Well, I have a severed hand. Do I, I don't do like that. This? It's the left hand that you're holding on in your right hand. <laughs> There's a severed hand. I wish I had another like a right hand that I held in my left hand. And I would just switch between them and be like, jazz hands, or something like that. What am I gonna do with this hand? Uh. I haven't no, it's okay. I've had with several people before knowing anything about me, or like either know, before knowing anything about me, or upon, upon like, just like getting to know me closer, have basically said, yeah, yeah, like, I, yeah, you pretty much seem like a mod from, from the start. That's fair. I wonder what people uh, think of me. I... Actually, I feel like I could guess. Actually, I don't think it really matters. Um, <laughs> uh, I know Aaron told me one of the, uh, uh, one of her, uh, gay friends. Mm -hmm. Uh, Shortly after, uh, shortly after meeting me, was, uh, it was it was interest was interested, uh, and uh, Aaron's like, yeah, I don't know anything about him, but uh, Aaron told me that he was like he, he like he immediately was like, oh yeah, he's probably he, he, I'm pretty sure he's a bottom. I'm pretty sure he's a bottom. I was like, <laughs> that was like just barely, that was like barely after meeting me. Happens, you know. Derek, I feel like most straight, most people in in your cosplay troop are probably bottoms that are men. That are I I, I can't I can't account for the gays, but uh, so, but I think I can account for both the straights and the bi's. It's weird because most of the most of the straight, at least the straight guys in. Absolutely true. I guess it's not weird, uh, but a lot of them, I don't. I like. I don't know. I don't know well, if that's just, the case or not. It's just, it's just a guess. I mean, if you can't, if you can't say for certain that it's wrong, then you have to think of the ones you do know. I just don't know for a lot of people. 
Well, who do you know? Is it true of the I'm people you know? Think. I know. I know one of them, or I, I I know one for sure is a top. I know one for sure is a bottom. Hmm. I'm honestly surprised to hear that there's uh, one that's a top. Uh, Just in the first place. It's it's know. tough to tell really because like most the thing the, see the thing is like a lot of people in Drew you know people don't talk like a top but uh, yeah as in like you know they're not they don't they don't say like like i, I feel like there's no way to to, to uh as a Honestly, guy to just say things with like top energy without sounding just creepy is the thing i mean yeah to some like, extent yeah i don't know i can tell you there's some like people I, who like sound like I a said, top like, and I want are very much not a top too where so, let, let me put this do way. I go? I, say, I have this hand. Let me put it this way. If I if I look, look at a character, I'm like, damn, I want that character to to, uh, to just to just like get on top of me and peg me. Mm -hmm. That's uh, that's that just sounds like corny energy. Yes. If I say if I said, corny damn, energy, I want to get on top of her trailer. Yeah. It sounds it just sounds like it 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 sounds worse. Yes. I feel like people are true. just less outspoken about it. This coin here, there's a Which thing. Which means if they're not saying that, they're, if they're not making bottom comments, they're probably a top. I really want to figure out where this hand goes. Or the, we didn't even count for switches. What's up? Uh, what's a switch but a bottom? <laughs> and sometimes a top. I'm... I <laughs> I feel like I feel like if you're if you're a switch, what you're really saying is, I I'm a bottom, but like if I have to, I can top. You know, honestly, that's, that's honestly that's that am. might actually be super fair from from what I've seen at that's, a personal that's level. How... Like that might that actually might be a very true. Like I I no well, I guess I've seen some women that are switches but prefer to top as opposed to bottom. Yeah, yeah, I feel like I feel like that's how it is. Like I feel like well, I people have a preference, of course. I shouldn't. I don't think it's really. I don't think I don't know if. Well, there's no there's defining really, answer for you know, e uh, like everyone. Derek. Well, yeah, of course, but like. We we didn't even account for the aces. Yeah. We didn't even account for the trisexuals. Oh. I don't know. Is that a thing? I was trying to think of a joke among that, but I didn't really think of anything. So I just kind of just said it, but uh, mm. yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I don't seem to have a use for this hand. Maybe I will just start giving myself from the round of high fives. What are they gonna do? Stop me? I could flush it down the toilet, Derek. That's what I must have to do with the hand. That's something you could try. Doesn't I'll put it in the hand. grinder. It wouldn't let me. But that is what no. I thought. The grinder is no longer in use. Man. Well, I was going to end the episode, but the need to poop has gone away. So I kind of... Let me aimlessly wander around looking for a use for this hand real quick. Are we going to do a third episode of this? What are you feeling? I'm, I, I feel like it all depends on what the hand does. You know, that's extremely fair. I mean, I'm fine, dude. You haven't even seen any porn. I know, right? I feel like we're missing, like, a you good know, portion of this game. What we could do is we could end the episode. Yeah. I could take another hint to keep me in the right direction. Um, and then we can uh, come back mm. and do a third episode. Maybe people... It's hard to gauge that, yeah. what people's Honestly. interest in a game is going to be. Especially given that this game is old, too. Mm. But, uh... I am a little curious to see what the hand does. So, yeah, why not? Next time on Spellitons. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll do one more episode and see what the hand does. Bye-bye.